Snow and ice came down in a hurry last night, which posed a big challenge for road crews. Workers in Cincinnati also faced a hurdle because of the amount of accumulating snow that ended up on the streets in the downtown area. A local 12 meteorologist Josh Knight has more on how crews are still dealing with that problem. Josh. That's right, Kit. As you can see, we are standing right downtown. We're right by 9th and here on Walnut, just outside of the library. And you might expect that a road like Walnut would look a lot better at this point. I mean, the snow ended last night. But what you'll notice is the plows don't actually run on this street because the streets are too narrow and the amount of right away they have to leave, the plows can't actually come by. So they're going about it another way. Earlier today, we watched as crews were cleaning some of those downtown streets, and what they actually use are these front-end loaders. Some of them are behind us right now as well, but this video shows you nice up close what they have to do. They load up all that snow because they can't just pile it up on the side of the street and actually put it in dump trucks and then haul it outside of town. Normally what they'll do with less snowfall is actually just pre-treat the roads and then use chemicals to try and break down the snow, but when the accumulation is this much, it's just too much for those chemicals to handle. At some point when the accumulation builds up, uh, there'll be a point when just salt treatment is not doing enough and not responding. The accumulation builds up on top of that when if it's enough snowfall, we'll actually have to get, get in there and get that snow loaded and get out of there. Now, to give you a little bit better of an idea of what it looks like once those front end loaders come through, I mean, you can see the road significantly better. The problem, it just takes a long time for them to get around to all the streets downtown. We've also seen them continuing to come by and spray more salt and more brine to also try and continue to break some of that down. The good news here is that because they won't plow, if you're parked on the side of the street right downtown, you're not going to get blocked in, but streets are clearly still a little bit of a mess. And it's a race against the clock kit as temperatures are expected to tumble again tonight. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Josh.